Dare is a cooperative multiplayer 3D dungeon crawling game. Players choose their character name and class, and will progress through a game world based on different interpretations of hell. Combating multiple demons and overcoming challenges such as teamwork based mechanics and intricate levels. Players must progress through three sections of hell, fighting past two bosses to reclaim their soul and win the game. The player is in control of one character that they travel through the game with. They then choose one of the three classes, Mage, Melee or Range. These classes enable different ways to play the game as they simply offer different affinities towards different playstyles. For example, Melee gives the player extra health from the get-go while giving them more wiggle room with some of the feature mechanics such as Light. Or range offers longer lock-on ranges and higher overall damage outputs. Mage offers great area damage and larger overall damage outputs as well. A player chooses one of these classes after creating their character. One of the primary mechanics in Dare is the light system. This is basically an item that is given to the players in the first stage of the game in the form of a torch that ties their damage inputs and outputs together. The lighter the area that the player is in, the more damage that they do. So if players venture too far away from the player holding the torch, then they will eventually deal less damage and they will have less maximum health overall. Dare handles difficulty in a different way to a lot of other games. Uh, it doesn't simply increase the health of enemies or lower the attack of the player, but it uses intuitive mechanic systems that players have to understand before they can fully combat the game. One of the key features of this game is the environment and the environmental designs. The first is akin to the tutorial section. This is based on European medieval dungeon styles. After this, players move into the Norse section, based on the Norse mythology of Helheim. The final section is based on Christian Hell, much more volatile, with lava and fire everywhere. This game follows a very RPG of MMO style of play, allowing friends to play together, venture through dungeons, and gain the same enjoyment they would from a high level MMO, but without any of the grinding. Dare's visual art style is fully rendered low poly 3D, with volumetric light and particle effects to create a unique visual that is not only enriching the player experience, but also makes the most out of the game world. Dare has a lot of elements that should appeal to different age groups in terms of audiences. The art style and gameplay are quite simple, as well as being colourful and bright, and there's very little complicated input. This opens the game up to a much larger audience. This is a full game, with several hours of content, and so it can be released on the Steam platform once development has finished. On top of this, with the controller support, this game could also go to other platforms such as PS4 and Xbox One. And that brings this pitching to an end. I'd like to thank you for watching. And the real George, not me, I'm just the digital George, will be more than happy to answer your questions.